So Epic decides to make a direct payment option to buy their V-Bucks for Fortnite, which will have the player, you know, basically get a 20% discount to where the money goes to Epic instead of, you know, Apple or Google, which normally if you buy V-Bucks, you normally buy it for the App Store or, um, you know, the Google Play Store in which Apple or Google normally gets about a 30% cut. Well, Google doesn't mind this because I bet you Fortnite is still on the Google Play Store. But Apple, though? Apple? Nah, nah, bruh. You see, Apple decided to take off Fortnite out of their app store because it is violating their policy. Or, in better terms, basically, they're not getting that 30% cut. Now, Apple, you know that a lot of people love to play Fortnite on your iPhones, your iPads. So, you might as well just put it back on there. Just put, it, put Fortnite back on there. Unless you plan on making your own Fortnite, which... Uh, yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> bro, Apple, you, you gotta change your policies. Yeah, something's gotta change because there's gonna be a lot of complaints about your product, Apple, about your app store at this point because Fortnite has been taken off. Fortnite is pretty much one of the biggest games in the app store. I mean, let's just be real. And the fact that a lot of kids now cannot play that game at this point on iOS, you know, that's going to upset a lot of kids and a lot of adults out there. Come on, Apple. Like, you, you, you got to change it up. You got to be a little bit less conservative. You got you to gotta loosen up. You, you got to loosen up, Apple. You got to. First xCloud and now Fortnite. What's it going to be next? You know, Apple lately has just been taking out apps, not accepting apps. You know, what's going to be the next app that they're going to take out? You know, Apple, you know, I'm using an iPhone to record this video. You know, they make good products. They do. They make good iPads. You know, it's considered as the best tablet. You know, they make pretty good cameras on their iPhones. They make pretty good phones. But when it comes to their policies... When it comes to applications, yeah, there's a reason why people don't really mess with Apple like that. And a lot of people out there, you know, they normally stick with Android because of the freedom and stuff like that. Downloading APKs from different sources and stuff like that. This is just one of those cases to where go with Android. If you want to play Fortnite, you got to go to Android. You know, it's just better to have, you know, an Android tablet or an iPhone, an iPad or an Android phone, you know, so that way you can get the best of both worlds. So that way, if something like this happens, then you wouldn't really feel as bad because you could just go on Android and play Fortnite on there or vice versa. But yeah, Apple... <laughs> Uh, I'm going to just have to say this. Hold this L. Hold this L. Nothing more, nothing less. But anyways, I've been rambling long enough. What do you guys think of Apple, you know, taking out, you know, Fortnite out of their app store? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below this video. See you guys later in peace. Hit that notification bell. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. When you hit that notification bell, you gotta hit all notifications. So that way you can be notified for future Levon Kaysen videos.